Hello, welcome back to Uncle Buffalo Live Cooking Show. Hello everyone, hello everyone, hello, 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 hello. Okay, my name is Uncle Buffalo. So, uh, every two or fortnightly, Wednesday, 8 p.m. is our time for the Buffalo or Happy Call Cooking Show. So today, Uncle Buffalo is going to use only one product because this item has not arrived in Australia yet. But we already start to do pre-order and the feedback, the response is really, really amazing. So me, for now on hand, I only have one sample. So for today, I'm going to use this, the only sample item to actually prepare two dishes. So what is the item that is so popular and already get a lot of response since we announced it, I think, last week? last uh, Wednesday. This is the latest Buffalo Stainless Steel Smart Air Fryer 2.0. All right, it's an air fryer. You know, Buffalo has been quite famous with their air fryer. We have the version one or, or the first generation, which is the blue color one, selling in Australia for, I don't know, seven or eight years. Very popular. And finally, now we have the second generation 2.0 and still, we maintain the stainless steel in a pot and it comes with more function. We call it Buffalo Pro Chef Us. All right? So uh, please share this video out. Uh, let your friends know, let your families know. We're going to cook two dishes today. And these two dishes, I will say normally, or if you don't have this Buffalo Pro Chef Plus, which is air fryer 2.0, you can't do it by using air fryer. All right? So you have other brands air fryer, you won't get the same result. This will happen only on the Buffalo Pro Chef Plus because we are going to stir fry. Yes, you heard me correctly, stir fry. So this product is an air fryer. So we use it for air frying. You can use it for deep frying. You can use it for roasting, baking, uh, defrost, grilling. 
And now you even can use this for stir fry. So it can be an air fryer, it can be a roaster, now it can be a wok. This is the amazing part of Buffalo Pro Chef Plus. All right, let me say hi to all the friends first. Linda Poa, hi, how are you? Pet Pet, <laughs> how are you? All right, for those that just join me, once again, welcome to Uncle Buffalo Live Cooking Show. So today, about one hour time, because I only have one air fryer on hand now. It's not arrived yet. So that's why we are doing pre-order. Okay, pre-order started last week. The result, the feedback, the response is amazing. Thank you so much for your support. We get a lot of pre-order from internet, online. We get a pre-order at our uh, kiosk or our outlets in the Glen Shopping Center in Glen Waverley. Uh, we get a lot of inquiries that call in to ask about this product. Because if you pre-order now, you save $100. The stocks will arrive on or around 20th of February. So today is 19th, right? Or 20th, 20th, 20th. Day. Okay, so one month. Okay, just like one month from now, the stock will arrive. You pre-order now. Instead of paying $399, you only need to pay $299. All right, you save $100 to pre-order this. So if you are still not sure how good is this product, then don't go away. Okay, watch this live video. It's going to take about one hour time or maximum, I would say about 50 minutes time to cook the dishes. I'm going to stir fry flat noodle, cha kui tiao. Yes, you heard me correctly. Cha kui tiao, stir fry flat noodle by using air fryer. How can you do that? Yes, you can if you are using Buffalo Pro Chef Plus, the air fryer 2.0. And I'm going to stir fry another dish, which is clams or pee, -pee. Stir fry clam using this. All right. Of course, on top of these this, this two dishes, you still can do a lot of nice dishes. Uh, as you can see from the video, when we played, or we played just now when we started the show. And later, we're going to repeat the video again, so you'll know what kind of dishes that you can cook. So feel free to ask questions. Hi, Yuki. Long time no see. All right. Hi. Hi, Nancy. Yes, Chak Wei Tiao. Correct. We're going to use this to cook a lot of different stuff. Now, um, you can ask question. Um, we, we are going to, you, you can also ask me what to cook. I'm going to show using another camera uh, clearly or clearer to show on the functions that we can actually use or how do we uh, use this air fryer. So before or without wasting time, I think I'm going to start with the chakui tiao. Okay, we're going to start with the chakui tiao. So first, what you need to know is, of course, open the lid. Um, maybe you'll try to use second. You can put both. You don't have to go solo first. Okay. Now, as you can see from the right-hand side, this is the air fryer 2.0 that I mentioned. We call it Buffalo Pro Chef Plus. All right? So these are all the panels. These are some... I'll come, in, come, come, come back this, uh, to this later because we have more time. So... For this one, to open the lid is a bit different from the first generation. The first generation, you can just leave it, leave it out. This one, it comes with a lock, so it's much more safer. So you have to push the lock, open it. Okay. On the other way around, when you want to close, you can just push. There's no lock mechanism for this one. You can just push, and when you hurt, it means it's locked or closed. Okay, open it. So now, here come the most important part. This is the standard steel. So this is 304 standard steel. All right. This is also one of the main features that Buffalo is selling and why Buffalo Air Fryer is so popular. Of course, most welcome by a lot of people because air frying, deep frying, baking, or even roasting are using high heat. So if you are using coated material, all right, Teflon or whatever, for that kind of temperature, it's not healthy. It's not healthy. It will harm you. So try not to use that kind of material, but try to use stainless steel. But it's not easy to find a stainless steel air fryer in the market. So this one is 304, food grade stainless steel, a very nice, high grade stainless steel. All right. So 
with this, you can see that it actually come without handle, no handle. So your question might pop up. How can we leave the whole standard steel pot out, especially when it is hot? And this is when this come in. I'll show you here. This is the holder that it comes together with the air fryer. Okay, just pull and I can put it here, put it back and I can leave the whole thing up. Okay, easy and simple. When you are done, put it back and you can just leave it there. All right, so you come with a few accessories, including, I'm not so sure if you can see on top, this part, that's a net, right? I already put the filter net on top. So the filter net will help you to reduce the grease that built up onto it. So you can just always remove this, remove the net and put it into dishwasher or soak in hot water for 15 minutes. So easier to clean. Uh, it also comes with this, a stainless steel rack, which we are not going to do in this, not going to use this today, but it's still very useful for other dishes, okay? Hey, before we start, hi, 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 more and more of my friends is watching. Welcome. Once again, I'm using the Buffalo Latest Air Fryer 2.0, which is Buffalo Pro Chef Plus to Cha Wei Diao. All right. Hey, let's go solo for camp number two. All right, now as you can see, this is the Buffalo Pro Chef Plus uh, air fryer. Okay, so I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to add in some oil for chocolate yao and I'm going to add in garlic and Chinese sausages. Okay, garlic and Chinese sausages, only these two. You can add fish cake if you want. Okay, you can add fish cake if you want. Just put it directly. Don't have to heat up. Just add in the pot directly. So at the same time, we have other ingredients that we already prepared. We have some green sprouts. We have prawns. We have chives. Okay? And of course, you need some kwetiao, flat noodle. This is a flat noodle. Okay? In Australia, we are quite lucky because it's easy to get this kind of flat noodle now in a lot of Asian grocery shops. Just go for the stir fry version, not those soup noodles. All right? And we have some sauce here, which I'll explain what are the sauce that I put it inside. So, again, I already put in oil, garlic, as you can see, and also the Chinese sausage. Right? So, close it. Now, set the function to stir fry. Menu. When you press menu, you can see that now it's on fry. Now it jumped to pizza. Now it stop at serve fry. Okay, I want to set serve fry is two hundred forty. Yeah, correct. I want to set the timing to twenty minutes. So I press temperature once and one more time. It's fifteen. So I need to add into twenty. So the whole chocolate process is twenty minutes. The whole chocolate is twenty minutes. I press start. So this is not good enough, even though it's already functioning. I try to show you the. Uh, out so it's functioning as you can see different from the uh, first generation it actually start rotating all right the inner port start rotating by itself okay but I want it to be more balanced so what should I do okay I try to set the tripod for a higher angle so you can see what I try to show you now this is good. You can actually press here to make it tilt. See? So when it tilt, it can actually do the stir fry thingy for you. Now the oil, the Chinese sausages, the garlic is stir fry inside. Now, now 
for the beginning, you won't see the obvious result. But later, when we put in the noodles, the flat noodles, you can see that you actually do a very good job. So actually tilt this air fryer to a side. So how does it look like from the front? It's actually tilting. Can you see it? Tilting to the side. You can choose to tilt to that side or this side is up to you. Okay? You can always just leave it up. Now it goes back to the normal uh, position. All right? So when you want to tilt, and you want to tilt it, just need to press down. There's a button here. And then tilt it back. As simple as that. Okay? If you have any question, so now we're going to wait when this timer reach 17. That means it has been stir frying and I already can smell it. I already can start smelling the Chinese sausages. It's actually stir frying, sauteing the garlic and also the Chinese sausages for three minutes. After three minutes, we're going to add something inside. So let me adjust back so feel free to ask any question because this is a uh, uh, very new a lot of people still don't know how to use it but i can tell you it's a very very good product uh we are doing pre-order now and we sold quite a lot okay so quite a lot it looks of course modern nice and uh, it's smaller actually it's seven liters compared to the first generation is 10 liters so it's much more easier to keep in your kitchen and look nice modern and it can still go with a lot of different function all right let's see from this angle there's no light so we can't see now we the, the light is the temperature so actually adjust it okay 17 17 you just start to show you for a while see it's actually stir frying by itself so now what we need to do is we're going to tilt it back and we're going to open the lid so when you open the lid it will stop automatically see how amazing is the result you can see that the oil is still popping means the heat is really good enough oh very good heat good temperature for stir frying so this we already get the fragrance really three minutes so next, what we need to do is we're going to add in the noodles and the seasoning sauces. So this, this is about half kilo, right? Yeah. Okay. Half kilo of the noodles. Add it in. Yeah, that's enough. And we're going to pour in the sauce. So here we have some sesame oil, dark soy sauce, light soy sauce, uh, some oyster sauce, and you can add in some salt and pepper. Have you added salt and pepper already, sir? Yes. Not sure, right? Okay, it's okay. Okay, we just pour everything inside. I'm going to add some salt and pepper. Okay, next, we're going to continue. See, I still have something that I didn't put it inside. If you are using raw prawn, then you can put it now. But I'm using cooked prawn, so I'll only put it in at the last three minutes. Okay, so I have chives and also the bean sprout. I'll put it at the last three minutes, not now. Okay, you can see up there, it's still very clean. This is the filter net. Okay, close it. As long as you close it, it automatically continue from where we stop. Okay, continue from where we stop. So I'm going to show you how I tilt it. Now you need to tilt it. So your kuei tiao, your flat noodle, 
good balance from stir frying. Okay, so you press here and tilt it and try to show lower. You can see the kuei tiao. That's it. Ah, it's stir frying by itself. See, this is how the machine or this Buffalo Pro Chef Plus stir fry flat noodles mixed with all the chinese sausages mixed with all the sauce and the orange light means the heat so the heat, heat goes off means it already reached 240 so it will goes off when the temperature temperature drops a bit the light will goes on again and it will keep stir frying it you see the lights on now Keep stir frying it. Very nice. Even. Balance. Okay. So. 50 minutes. So we're going to wait until last three minutes. Then we add in other ingredients. Okay. We'll add in the chives. And also green sprout. And also the, what do you call that? Um. Prawn. Simple and easy. If you think the color is not dark enough, we can add some dark soy sauce later. So it's totally up to you. You want it to be darker or you want to be lighter. Okay? Just as simple as this. And it's stir fry. Amazing. Okay, turn back to cream one, please. Just came one is good enough. All right, let me keep this first in the show later. So as you can see from the uh, background, this is the Buffalo Smart Air Fryer 2.0 stainless steel. Okay, stainless steel, and it looks so nice. Okay, modern, elegant. Okay, and it's about 6.6 .6 kilogram. The size for the inner pot is 7 liters. So it's smaller compared to the last one. But the difference is the first generation comes with a lot of accessories. Let's say you want to stir fry something or you want to uh, make sure it turns 360, you need to put in the baking cage. So now this generation comes without the baking cage because the inner pot itself will rotate. And when you turn it aside, tilt it to a side, 45 degrees, you will get a very nice rotating or stir fry result. So you save one more accessories to wash. You don't have to wash the baking cage. No baking stick. Okay, come with a rack. So you still can do a lot of things. So my my customer asked me the first question: Can you still roast the whole chicken? Of course, if you are talking about 1.8 kilogram, the big chicken, the big bird, you can't because it can't fit it and it can't roast anymore. But you still can roast the chicken by cut into butterfly shape. Butterfly shape. Okay? Or boneless. These two you still can do. Right? Let's see. If there, is there any question? Uh, roast time. Will the step-by-step -step recipe be posted on the Facebook group? Uh, I can do that. I can repost the recipe later or you can go and get it now because I already upload this recipe to www.unclebuffalo.com.au www.unclebuffalo.com.au It's simple, it's easy, and it smells good. <laughs> because now I already can smell it. But there's no smoke coming out. Right? So why we need to use or buy Buffalo Stainless Steel Smart Air Fryer 2.0 Pro Chef Plus. Why? First of all, because it's stainless steel. When it is stainless steel means it's healthier. You don't have to worry about the coating peeling off, especially when you use this for air fry, for stir fry, for roasting, for baking, for grilling. All this high heat method will actually damage the coating uh, material. So by using stainless steel, no worry. Okay, you don't have to worry about peeling off and it's durable. And we are the only one in the market selling this type of stainless steel. 
uh, since our air fryer with the stainless steel in a pot. Okay, and the second thing is it comes with the rotating function, the tilting function. So as you can see from what I show you just now, it's stir frying by itself. You do char kway tiao, you don't even have to stand there. Use your hand to char, no need. Just put everything inside and it turns by itself like what it's, he's doing now. So you can just act like me, talk, talk, talk and do whatever you want to do. When you come back and it is done. Simple. The third reason is easy to clean. You see there's no, I'm cooking now. Huh? You can see there's no steam or smoke coming up. No, you can feel the heat. Yes. Because it's hot, but there's no smoke coming out. So that means it's easier to clean. Your kitchen won't be a mess. And that's the reason we launched this in Australia last week. And the feedback, the response is amazing. Thank you so much for your support. We still have quota for pre-order. All right. Original price is 399 Now the stocks hasn't arrived yet. It will only arrive roughly around 20th of February, which is one month from now. If you purchase now, you can purchase through unclebuffalo.com.au or you can go to our shop or outlet in Glen Waverley, located inside the Glen Shopping Center, Market Hall near the coast. We only, uh, the, the price is only $299 for pre-order. You save $100. Save $100 for this amazing product. Uncle Buffalo, me, myself, has been observing this product for one year. This product, uh, we have been selling in other countries, by Buffalo, of course. But because in Australia, we have to be very careful. We have to make sure that, especially electrical appliances, we have to make sure that it has the certification approved by Australia. And also, we have to make sure that the product quality is good. Because if the product quality is bad, we're going to spend a lot of money on on, on repairing or replacing, this is what we don't want to happen in Australia. So that's why I've been observing this product, this item, this model for almost a year. And finally, we decided to sell Buffalo Pro Chef Plus, one of the amazing air fryer plus, roaster plus, whatever you call it. For me, it's the best. It is the best helper. We decided to sell this in Australia. With a very good price, original price two hundred ninety nine. If you pre-order today, pre-order now, you save one hundred dollar. You just need to pay two hundred ninety nine. How to pre-order? Go to my website. That's the easiest way: unclebuffalo.com.au, or go to our shop in Glen Waverley. Yeah, I'm looking at the question now. Pat, Pat say, where is the ventilation fan? Is it hard to clean? Um, the fan. Is actually on top of the machine, which you can't see it. And by putting the, what do you call that, the, the filter net, it actually reduces a lot of grease to go into the fan. So it's, you don't have to wash it, I will say that. You don't have to wash it. What you need to do is wash the net. The filter net, you can purchase separately. Okay, you can buy more. At our kiosk, or later, I'm going to put online also. So let's say you use it for three months, four months, and you don't want to wash, you can always change a new one, and it's not expensive. It is not expensive. All right? So, uh, it's easy to clean. And the fan is on top. The, the, the noise that you can hear now, the roo, is from the fan. And why do we need a fan? Because the heat comes from top. That is fine in very ray. So, if the heat only goes from top to the bottom, it's one way. So, the food won't cook nicely. To make sure the food cook nicely, there's a fan on top. To make sure that the heat will circulate 360 degrees. So we will get both sides cooked nicely, evenly. So there's a small fan on top. All right, it, it works act, act exactly the same as the first generation, but with some modification. I hope I can. I hope I answer your question, Pepe. And uh, Junte, even though air fried chicken or roast pork also no smoke, Junte, I would say most of the time no smoke unless you put a lot of oil or when it burn the fat. Sometimes it will come out a little bit smoke. I won't lie to you. The okay, Uncle Buffalo sell items, sell product in Australia for so many years. I don't want to lie to customers. Sometimes if there's too much fat, it will create some smoke. This is because of the fat, not because of the machine. Okay? So try to reduce the fat because when you buy air fryer, you try to eat healthier. Am I right? So try to reduce the fat and you will get the result. So you can see as what I'm doing now. I actually put some oil. 
on the kuitiao because I want the kuitiao to be smooth, not too sticky. I put a bit of oil. But the, the, the result is really good. The result is really good. Okay? So, you can always open halfway to check on the kuitiao and to make sure the color is nice. So, I'll normally open it and check. Okay, for me, the color is nice. Oh, let me show cam too. Sorry. Okay. I like the color. It's not done yet. Huh? It's only halfway. Huh? It's not done yet. And you see, it's nasty. Very nice. Okay. It's not 100% done yet. But the color is If you think it's not dark enough, then you add the uh, dark soy sauce. Up to you. But for me, I think this is good. So you can always just close it back. And then it will continue by itself. See? Six minutes. I'll wait until it uh, left three minutes. Uh, I'm going to put in the uh, uh, prawns and green sprouts and also chives. Back to them one, thank you. Okay, again, for those that just turn on or join my live show, welcome. And this is Uncle Buffalo Live Show. And um, what we are cooking is we are using this, as you can see from my background, the latest buffalo Stainless steel smart air fryer. Nice, huh? Look elegant. Huh? With the black and red color. I love it a lot. Especially now, New Year, Chinese New Year approaching. I can buy this as a Chinese New Year gift. Uh, but it will only arrive 20th of uh, February, like, a little bit late, but it's okay. Lah. Okay? So this one, we can cook a lot of things. Um, I'm going to play the video later so you can see what we can cook. And uh, at the same time, like today, we stir fry two dishes. Why I purposely stir fry because most of the air fryer in the market they can't do that they can air fry they can deep fry they can roast they can grill they can't stir fry so by the tilting function by this buffalo pro chef crust you can stir fry so i'm going to stir fry chakritya which i already done it we are going to done in five minutes time and we are going to do this stir fry clam later okay so I hope you will like it. Uh, it's not difficult. It's quite easy. All the recipes already on my website, which is unclebuffalo.com.au. These two dishes that we cook today. So in the video, we actually shoot it last week. We also do roast pork. We did some, uh, what else do we do? Uh? Uh, some frozen food. Okay, how to uh, deep fry the frozen food. We also, do, you can use this to pan fry egg. Okay. Next time I can show you how to pan fry egg. You can use this to fry uh, shallots. Uh, what else do we cook? Uh, roast pork. I, I tell them our uh, chicken. We roast the whole boneless chicken. Okay, so a lot of different dishes. I'm going to show you. Oh, uh, you can see from the uh, background. So here, these are all the dishes that we can cook. Uh, you can find a lot of video on YouTube also. So I just want to let you know the original price is three hundred ninety nine. Uncle Buffalo is doing a very good deal for the pre-order. You can tell, you can say this is a Chinese New Year or Lunar New Year deal. Instead of $399, you just need to pay $299. Save $100 for the pre-order. Okay, stocks will arrive next month, 20th of February. Okay, three minutes. Show Camp 1, please. Camp 2, Camp 2, please. Okay. Pull it back. Three minutes. So we open it directly. Look at the color. Nice. But it's not done yet. So what we need to do is put in the chives. Bean sprout. You like it more, you put more. Lah. You don't like it, you put less. Lah. This is always uh, very personal. <laughs> this prawn is quite a lot. Lah. I don't put too, them. I don't, I don't put that many. Lah. Okay. Uh, but if you want to put more, it's up to you. Okay, so now close it back. As soon as you close it, it will start turning already, rotating already. Okay, but this is not enough. Always remember, this is not enough. We want it to be tilting so that it can get a very good stir fry result. So, what you need to do is there's a button here, press it and let it tilt. Now it's stir frying. 
I see the bean sprout, the prawn, the noodle. It's stir fry by itself. Okay, so you get a very nice result. All right. Mmm. Good. Come on, please. Gosh, you see, I have three minutes. All right. Ask me if you have any question. Eh? What's the question? Oh. Let me see. Rose Thorn, what's your question? In terms of portion size, can we cook more than what you have put in there in one go? Oh, Rostan, if you're talking about the uh, Chakwe Diao, yes, yes, yes. Uh, because I'm just doing demo, <laughs> cooking demo. So I cook only 500 gram. Uh, for this one, you can put about one kilogram of the Chakwe Diao. Good enough. Of course, you might need a little bit longer time. And what I will advise is uh, open up halfway to make sure that it stir nicely. But don't go too much, okay? Don't go too much. Make sure that the food won't touch the top. Then maybe a bit difficult to clean up. Uh, so from 500 gram up to about one kilogram, it's fine. It's fine. They just double up all the uh, sauce and ingredients. Okay. Any question? So if we don't have question, uh, Never mind, because only one more minute. We will make sure that it's done. And we'll show everybody. And I can eat in front of you guys. Yes, sir. Huh? No need, no need. I can use this plate. Because later, you're going to take the whole thing down, wash it, and then uh, bring it up because we only have one machine. That's why you prepare the video later. Okay, you heard the sound. Now turn to cam two. Oh, so it's already done. Zero, zero, zero. Okay. So there's a button here. Oh, put back. You don't have to press. Let's put it back. Even though me and myself is so not so familiar yet. Okay. It's done. Let's open it. We mix it for a bit. See, the color is so nice. You can stir fry your kuei tiao without using a wok look at the the bottom part still non-stick right this is standard steel huh eh? this is standard steel look at the quality okay sausage quality and the prawns yummy right so again if you want to hold this thing up, take it out. Remember, it comes with this. This is a holder. Okay, and you can see there's a gap here for you to put the holder. Just pull down, and this is open. Put it in, and then just press. You can hold the whole thing up. And then put it in, open, and remove this. Okay, show you again. Put it in, let's press, and then the whole thing is up. Put it down, let's pull and release. Okay, so, quick gel is done. Can you give me like a like and love part? I think the quick gel is very nice. Tastes good too. And uh, this is the first dish. Simple and easy. I didn't uh, need to wash a lot of things i didn't i don't have to clean a lot of things around this okay no smoke no smoke coming out so it's easy simple and this part a lot of people said wow oh, the filter net part is difficult to wash nah, still clean see later just need to remove this and then we can put in dishwasher or just soak into the hot water so it's simple easy to take care easy to maintain okay so um we play the video which video we're going to play first the cooking video okay i'm going to play your cooking video to show you what are the other items that you can cook by using this and later we come back we're going to cook the stir fried clam right see you later
Okay, welcome back to our live show. As I show you from the video, um, today we are introducing one of the hot, popular hot item that has been in a topic a lot of people is discussing since last week when we launched it, which is the Buffalo Smart Air Fryer, Standard Steel Air Fryer 2.0, or we call it Pro Chef Plus. And this air fryer launched last week, but the stock hasn't arrived yet. It will only arrive in one month time, 20th of February. So we're doing pre-order now. The price is 399 If you pre-order, you only need to pay 299 So what you need to do is just go to my website, www.unclebuffalo.com.au, or you can visit um, Uncle Buffalo Kiosk or Shop Outlet in the Glen Shopping Center, which is in uh, Glen Waverly. All right? So, um, just now, we show you how to use the air fryer to do stir-fry stuff. So, this is one of the reasons this product has been selling very well. Because you can use it to air fry. As you can see in the video, I use it to air fry chicken wings or wingnuts and drumettes. And we use it to air fry some frozen food without oil at all. It did a very good job, but at the same time, you also can use this to stir fry. So we already stir fry the chakwi tiao, which is flat noodle. Uh, that will be my dinner tonight. And we are also going to use it to stir fry clams. All right. So if you have any question, please ask. So I can answer your question. All right. Okay. Okay. Um, Zenti Kuang, how to fry salmon? A very good question, Zenti. I already did this before, fry salmon. If you want the recipe, uh, you can actually go to my website, unclebuffalo.com.au. There are two categories, air fryer and air fryer 2.0. So the salmon is in air fryer. So even though it's two different products, but they use the same method. So you can use that. For salmon, you will need this, okay? This is the rack that you can insert into the inner pot. So you put your salmon on top. You see, um, like me, my daughter loves salmon. So sometimes we buy just one slice of the salmon fillet for her to go with rice. And uh, the simple way is just put the salmon, the salmon, the salmon on top of the rack and I spray some oil on the skin because I want to get it crispy skin. And I use bake function for around 10 minutes or 12 minutes. It depends on the size of the salmon, right? So if it's thicker, you need longer time. If it's thinner, you need a shorter time. And it also depends on what, how cooked you want it to be. Because salmon, somebody love it pink, somebody love it brown. So you can adjust the temperature by yourself, but just put it on top and you can do it. Air fryer come with a lot of functions. Not necessary, you use it for so many things. Sometimes you can you just use it to reheat or defrost. Also can. All right. Okay. Now I'm going to put my uh, uh, inner pot in. Yes. Uh, cam 2. Yes, cam 2. So we just wash it just now uh, so that we can cook second dishes. So what are the dish that we are preparing for today? Uh, it's the clams, this here. You can buy the raw one or you buy the cooked one. Uh, now it's easy to get the cooked one in, uh, what do you call that, Asian grocery shop. So just soak it for one or two hours to make sure that it's clean. Uh, and then we need some shallots, uh, garlic, ginger, spring onion, chili, and this is uh, coriander for garnish. And we need some sauce. We have the um, saucing wine, the saucing wine. We have some oyster sauce, some dark soy sauce, some light soy sauce, and some sugar. Okay, so are you ready? Okay, let's uh, start with some oil because we need to saute or we need to stir fry the ingredient first. What other ingredient we need to stir fry? We'll just put it in. Some, not chili, chili will put it later. Shallots, uh, half of the spring onion. 
garlic, ginger. These are the things that we need to stir fry first. Okay, we save the chili later. So same thing as what I did for the chai kuei tiao. Close it. I'll choose the function. Press start. Menu. Oops. Menu. So you see that the light is here. This is fry. One more time is pizza. Now I go to stir fry. Okay. Timing, I need 15 minutes. So I think the preset timing is 15 minutes. Just nice. So I press start. So as soon as I press start, it start rotating already. Okay, again, to make sure that it get a nice stir fry result, we make it tilt like this. So you can see that it's stir frying by itself. Okay. Do it for three minutes. Do it for three minutes, three to five minutes. Go back to camera. I'm going to do it for three to five minutes and then later I'm going to chill it back and put in clams and also uh, the other ingredients. So what are the sauce? I'm going to read it out. Again, I already put all the all this sauce or recipe in my website, which is unclebuffalo.com.au. We have sourcing wine, oyster sauce, sugar, soy sauce, dark soy sauce, and some pepper. Okay. So after three to five minutes, we're going to put in a seasoning. Uh, we're putting the clam, the seasoning, and red chili, and continue cooking until it's done. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, the spring onion normally I'll put at the last one or two minutes. Yes. Hold on, please. Huh? Junte, do we need to preheat first before adding the ingredients? No, you don't have to do that. You see, even though for the first generation of air fryer, a lot of people like buffalo product because we don't have to reheat. Most of the oven, most of the air fryer will request you to reheat, then only you cook. Buffalo Pro Chef Plus cook directly. You can see what I did just now. This is a live show. No cheating. I put it inside directly and cook immediately. No heating. No heating means it saves your time. You also save your energy. Save your energy means saving your money. So don't waste the money to pay electricity bill. Come back to Uncle Buffalo and buy more stuff. Better, right? Okay. So at the same time, while we are still waiting, uh, I would like to announce um, I'm going to have a special show on 31st of January, which is a Sunday, uh, 2 p.m. with Karen Chan, one of a very famous chef, Baba Nyonya chef. Um, and she is going to be here using buffalo and happy Cow products to prepare some Chinese New Year dishes, right? Then this is a special show. I'm going to be here, work together with Karen. I'm going to give away a lot of prizes too because it's Lunar New Year, okay? So last two weeks, um, those that are one month ago, for those that watch my show with Chef Ray from Roti Bar, you know that we give out a lot of nice prizes so if you miss that don't miss the next one 31st of january 2 p.m watch the live show from youtube or facebook you'll get a chance to win a lot of prizes too okay let's go back to camp two now 12 minutes means already five minutes uh, three minutes past i can smell the shallots the garlic the ginger really good so what we're going to do now is we're going to add in clams. So again, there's a button here. You have to press to open. And when you pull up, it will stop automatically. Okay? Tastes very nice. Okay? So now, clams. Let's put it in. So you see, one thing good about stainless steel, you don't have to worry about the shell. These shell are hard. If these... It's not stainless steel. You put this in, I tell you, are oh, all scratches and it will start peeling off. So that means you can change from clams to crab or you want to stir fry lobster, you can. In this, you can change. 
Like just now, when I do a uh, char kway teow, you don't want to do flat noodle. You can change to rice. You can change to uh, uh, normal noodles. It's fine. Or you want to do pad thai. It's fine. Okay, sousing wine. Uh, today is not, not me prepared. If I'm the one who prepared, I'll put more. Lah. Because I love the taste. Uh, the sousing wine go with the clams. This is the dark soy sauce. This is a light soy sauce. And we have the uh, oyster sauce. Let's put everything inside. And we have some sugar. I'll add in some pepper. Okay. Close the lid. Now we make it, yeah, we make it tilt again. So it's keep stir frying. All right. Okay, go back to come one. You pre-cook the clams with water before putting them into the air fryer. The clams are all open. Pepper, as what I mentioned just now, today I use the cooked clams. All right? It's already cooked. Nowadays, if you go to Asian grocery shop, you go to the frozen um, uh, department. They have raw and cooked, but mostly they are selling those cooked. I love the cooked one because, first of all, it's cleaner. It's easier to handle. Second thing, they cook it on the boat. They didn't cook it after they catch it or, or when they reach the pot. They cook it after they call it. They cook immediately on the boat. So it's fresh. It locks all the, the seawater with it. And then they, 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 they vacuum seal it. Okay? So it's easier for us to handle. Of course, if you want to get the raw one, it's up to you. But you might need to spend more time to clean it. Okay? And you don't have to pre-cook, right? You don't have to pre-cook. 15 minutes inside the air fryer is good enough for the shell to open. You don't have to pre cook. Okay, uh, while we are waiting, can we play one more time for the video? Uh, and you can see what are the dishes that we can cook by using Buffalo Pro Chef Plus. That's it. Have you seen the video? Amazing, right? And cook a lot of things. Of course, air fryer, Uncle Buffalo has been showing you what are the dishes we can cook in the air fryer, even though it's a first generation. Those that you can cook in first generation air fryer, mostly you can cook at second generation. You want to know what are the dishes I cook or I prepare? You can check out my recipe in unclebuffalo.com.au, which go to the recipe part. So like breakfast cup, 
uh, means actually bake a bread plus bacon, uh, salmon uh, cooked with udon noodles. Um, we do fried chicken. We 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 roast cheese the whole chicken. Uh, we do grilled fish. You can do pizza. Um, you can bake some of the defrost. Uh, so air fry, some frozen food, all these stuff that you can do in the first generation, you can use it in the second generation. So for second gener generation, which is the one that you are looking at, this one, it has one special function, which is self-rotating by itself, and it also can tilt 45 degrees, so it can stir-fry. So you can use this for stir-fry noodles, uh, stir-fry fried rice, we do the stir-fry clams, Veggie, you can put some capsicum, some prawn, so you can stir fry by itself. Um, I'm going to try out something. Um, I don't know how to say it in English, uh, but it's a glutinous rice. Stir fry glutinous rice. You see, glutinous rice normally we cook by rice cooker, right? But in Hong Kong, uh, there's one dish we call it San Chao Lo Mai Ban. So you stir fry, add water until it's cooked. So I'm not sure will it work on this one. But I think it will. So this will be my next project. So if it can be done, maybe next cooking show, I'll show you how to do that. All right, it's going to be very, very interesting. So again, if you have any question, please ask because uh, I can smell that the, the clams smells really good now with the shallots, with the ginger, everything inside, and it keeps stirring. So mix very well together. We still have six minutes time. And the last three minutes, I'm going to add in the rest of the spring onion and some chili. So if you want more gravy, you can add water and put some uh, cornstarch to make, make sure it's, it's thick. Uh, but I don't think I'll do it now because I prefer it without cornstarch. I prefer it like this, but it totally depends to you. Okay, so it depends to you. Um, in the recipe, I did prepare the cornstarch and water. Okay. So once again... Uh, remember, after this show, we're going to have another show on 31st of January, which is a Sunday, uh, 2 p.m. So about 10 days from now, right? 2 p.m., Karen Chan from Baba Nyonya, a very good Baba Nyonya chef. They're amazing. She cooked a lot of nice dishes. I worked with her for a few occasions. And she also appeared on some TV shows. Uh, you can get her recipe from her, her blog, uh, Malaysian. And uh, she, well, I'm very happy that she uh, able to make it to join me on 31st of January, 2 p.m. So um, we're going to cook, if I'm not mistaken, three dishes. Okay, three dishes, uh, something very interesting. Um, not difficult, but looks incredible. So uh, stay tuned and remember to join us. But the most important thing is we also give away a lot of prizes, at least eight to ten different prizes to give away. So what you need to do is just share the video or answer some question and you might be the winner. So this is for the Lunar New Year. We only do this for some special occasions. The last one is Christmas and the next one will be Lunar New Year. Okay, so we still have five minutes to go. Any question you can ask, all right? Let me check back. I'm going to add more uh, recipe on my website so you can always follow it um, but the best way to get the recipes because not only from me if you join the group you also get some recipes from the members so what group is that it's a Facebook group just need to go to Facebook and search for Uncle Buffalo's friends right Uncle Buffalo's friends search for this group and join in from time to time we're going to give away some special promotion only for the group members and uh, we're going to share new recipes as soon as we have it on the group. So some of the members will also show uh, new recipes from what they cook uh, so you can learn. Or you can ask, if you have any question, you want to ask how to clean this, how to clean that. It's simple and easy. All right, so all the parts we sell separately too. Okay, so again, today we are using this uh, Buffalo Stainless Steel Smart Air Fryer 2.0. First generation already get very good feedback from a lot of customers that's why we have been selling it for six or seven years now here comes the second generation i observe it for one year and i think it's a good product and the pre-order price is only 299 you save 100 dollars, which the original price is 399 can two please okay till it back open it 
So it stops automatic automatically. Oh, so nice. Haven't done yet. Oh, but smells really good. Smells really good. So that's now we only take half of the spring onion. Now we're gonna put it in and the chili. Put everything in. And continue stir fry for the last three minutes. Last three minutes. Okay. You also can tilt there if you want. It's totally up to you. Last three minutes. So this product is a roaster, it's an air fryer, and now it's also a wok. It's also an oven. Okay? Oven. Um what what different between this and oven is oven use a lot of um, energy. Then we go back to Cam One first. So my my customer asked me a lot of questions. First of all, what's the difference between this Buffalo Pro Chef Plus compared to oven? Oven use a lot of energy. It's about uh, 2,400 watt. This is about 800 to 1,000 watt. So it's, it's half half from the oven. And uh, secondly the oven you can't move here and there it's not possible okay and uh, this one you can move so oven cook by using hot wind so let's say you roast pork uh, you roast meat chicken the skin is nice but the <clears throat> the skin is nice but the hot meat itself will become very dry because the the wind blow the air will actually make all the juice or, 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 or it's not juicy at all okay so it become very dry. This one, it will lock all the juice inside. We do uh, roast pork. The pork, when you cut, is still very juicy. So compared to normal air fryer, it's the same. Those air fryer, the drawer style, it's not using fire in ready to cook. Huh? They're using hot wind to cook. So the chicken come out, wow, the skin very nice. But when you cut, especially the breast part, it's very dry, not moisture at all. But buffalo air fryer, using fire in ready, which is the light that you saw just now, to lock the moisture inside the meat. So when you cut it, it's still juicy, moisture, okay? And you don't have to preheat, save a lot of money too, okay? Right, one minute, and we're almost done. So, remember, the price is 399 We are doing pre-order now. Stocks arriving around 20th of February. You save $100. You just need to pay 299 for the pre-order. Very good product. Go to Cam2 now, thank you. Okay, hang up. It's already done. Let's open it. Ta -da! This is our stir fry clams. Okay. Stir fry clams. So you can just pour this directly on the plate and then serve it. Okay, let me try one. Ooh, it's hot. Okay. Ooh, hot. The fried clam, very nice. Oh, it's too hot. I don't think I can eat. It's still very, very hot. Okay, Let me take one. <clears throat> Come on, ah, uh, like it. Please give me a love or like, because this result, I tell you, you can't do it in any other air fryer in Australia. Only Buffalo. Hey, go back to come one, please. Only buffalo, right? Clam. PP. We'll call it la la in Malaysia. Mm. Very nice. Very, very nice. <laughs> you don't you didn't expect that you'll get this kind of result, even with a little bit of walk, hey by using air fryer hmm amazing oh nice good that's for my dinner okay i think it's all for today so if you have any question you can so um message me or write down in the comment section i'll try to answer when i have time <laughs> or else i'll 
put more time on looking for more new recipe. Want to look for new recipe? Visit unclepuffalo.com.au or you can text me with my number 0426. I can't remember my number. <laughs> 559008, right? Okay. 0426 You can text, you can ask. All right. So that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. You can still keep sharing this video. The video will be recorded and put in my Facebook and YouTube. You can come back and watch later. All right. So we'll see you on the next cooking show, which is 31st of January, 2 p.m. Uncle Buffalo with Karen Chan. See you. Bye.